Hi, this is Jason Roberski. I'm the CEO of JRLX Incorporated. I am Bob Mentley, the Associate Product Manager at Elation Lighting. I am Noah Kimmel. I'm the Production Director here at the Christ Community Church at our St. Charles South Elgin campus. So all of this actually began pre-COVID, uh, and it started uh, as kind of a dual discussion about a house light upgrade, a key lighting upgrade, and a power controls upgrade. We were really looking at how can we not only replace uh, failing outdated infrastructure and equipment, but how can we use this, use this project to help move us forward? The Fuse Profile, I remember specifying in the very, very beginning because you know, it uses an RGB amber mint additive color mixing engine. It had every feature in the book, uh, you know, from animation to gobo wheels, framing shutters were a, a required specification point, I would say here, spec point of, of the fixture. But it has an incredibly high CRI in excess of 90. The fuse profiles for key light um, have gone beyond just being convenient to focus. Um, They've allowed us at different times of the service to do different uh, colors on the front line, you know, where we have one person spotlit, but then the rest is uh, washed in a color, done some neat stuff with gobos, and it's just generally been way more user-friendly for volunteers. And it pairs nicely with the Fuse pendant house light because they're using the same color spectrum engine. So they're both additive color, um, the only difference is the, the moving light uses an amber chip, whereas the house light uses a white chip because we want better white light. One of the cool things about the Fuse pendant is that there's a whole range of accessories that snap onto the front of it, whether it's lenses, half hats, top hats, etc. So we actually ended up going with a combination of lenses. The ease of controllability with the abstract and CMY color modes, the full spectrum output, of the fuse pendant and the, the luminous, you know, efficiency is incredible out of that fixture. The ability to change the colors of the house lights um, really allows us to eliminate that division between the stage and the, the house. The, the ability to create the room as one big wash of color really makes it feel less of a performance and more of, more of a worship environment where everybody is a part of one big action. In house lighting, you want a very even coverage. Uh, you don't want a lot of variance in illumination levels. Let's say you want all of your fixtures hung at one single height, um, but you have variance in elevation of, of the floor. You would want to uh, change your lensing so that the, the, the spacing and the aesthetics look proper um, and also the lighting coverage is, is even. We went from 6,575 watt fixtures to 49 230 watt fixtures, but 230 watts is running flat out on the fuse pendant, which means the actual power is even less. So it's less fixtures at less than half the wattage roughly. And beyond just the power savings, we have savings in consumables. We're no longer buying gels and lamps. Um, as well as the labor savings and not having to change out lamps and gels. Mm -hmm.